But how? Focus on the bigger picture. No, 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 no. Focus on the details that make up the big picture. Firstly, the skull was replaced, not just stolen. Why? Well, obviously someone wanted to discredit the find. Uh, Pretty good copy. Even you couldn't tell till you tested it, Dr. J. A remarkable paleontological replica. Expertly crafted. Intricate detail. Definitely created by someone who had first-hand knowledge of the real skull. Peter. Peter. Stolen. I can't believe it. That's horrible. Yes. But fortunately, once I have determined the molecular structure of the tooth, my new tracing system should have no difficulty in locating the skull. You should see the sucker work. Dr. J can zero in on a sand flea in a windstorm. Thank you, Andrew. The point is, we should be able to find it in the next two or three hours. That's wonderful. I'll alert McGregor at the Gazette to stand by. Excellent, Peter. I'm picking him up nice and clear. He just turned left off Main, heading north on Elm. Roger, we're on it. I think this is the first time we've ever worked together. Yeah, well, it's the first time we've ever seen eye to eye on anything. <laughs> uh, except the time we both wanted to Robbie the robot for Christmas. We both get underwear. <laughs> I don't get it. Peter was so loyal. I wonder what would make him do such a thing. Five years down the road, he rediscovers the skull, perhaps the glory. Wait a minute. What glory? He did it for the money. Glory. Money. Glory. Money. Glory. Money. Glory. He just entered the Garber Arms Hotel. Good work, Andrew. We're going in. Just sit tight until you hear from us. I still save money. I'll take that. Clever switch, Peter. Unfortunately, too clever. One thing still puzzles me. Did you do it for the money or the glory? I can answer that. Monumental oil was behind this find. They are. Problem is, I promised a few private investors there'd be no delay in drilling. So you see, not only are fortunes at stake, so is my life. Now let's add a little fuel to the fire. Can't be serious. Deadly serious. As soon as this gauge reaches maximum, the skull will be totally incinerated, and you'll be joining me. I hate to spoil a little barbecue, Methy, but the police will be arriving at any minute. You see, I planted a tracking device right here, under Peter's lapel. Nice try. Hey, what's going on? Stupid machine. Just a few more minutes. That's okay. Take your time. We had a deal, Methy. You were paid in full. If you hadn't insisted on keeping this damn skull, this whole thing would have gotten out of control. Guess you were right, Hart. Did it for the money. No, Ben. The way I see it, you were right. He did it for the glory. I know this is gonna sound squishy, but I'm sorry I got us into this. You know, I've always hoped that the Cold War between us would melt, but 
This isn't what I had in mind. Why did you come back? Why? Well, I wanted to show you that I could do something important, too. I wanted you to be proud of me. I've always been proud of you. You have? Ever since I've known you. Yeah, well, not as proud as I've been of you. Isn't that just like you? Always having to go me one better. Well, time's run out. No! while you get the skull. To Hartley Jeffcoat, who found one of the oldest human fossils. And that does not refer to me, Andrew. <laughs> wait, wait. To Dr. Benjamin Jeffcoat, a brilliant scientist, a valiant adventurer, and the finest brother a guy could have. Oh. Right, cheers. 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 <laughs> Can I do it now? Yeah. A little surprise, Benny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what do you need? Um. Oh! 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 I don't know what to say. Three speeds. White saddle, balloon tires, even the bell. It's exactly the same bike. Except, actually, mine was blue. No, Benny, it was red. No, it was blue. It was red. Blue. Your bike was red. Blue. Red. Blue. Red. Blue. Red. I'm not getting in the middle of this one. <laughs> <laughs>